A nonprofit initiative taking care of the Panhandle's youngest victims is expanding. In November, we told you about Operation Warm Hearts, giving Walton County first responders tackle boxes equipped to help young kids. As News 13's Kimber Collins tells us, there are now hundreds of kits across the Panhandle, and organizers say the need is still growing. Some Panhandle first responders equipment checklists have expanded. Like on a fire truck, when they check for their oxygen, they're also checking for their Operation Warm Heart box. Created by nonprofit Healing Tools for Warriors, the volunteer team gave 25 tackle boxes to Walton County Sheriff's Office and Defuniac Springs Fire Department last fall. Each box filled with diapers, toys and blankets for kids, baby formula and much more. We had a family that had a fire and obviously when you have a fire, you have exactly what you had when you run out of the house. So they were able to give a family diapers, a bottle, water, give the kids something to drink, the, the younger kids, uh, give them a toy, something to keep them busy, distract them a little bit. Operation Warm Hearts made 250 more with the help of groups like Cross Point Church, now equipping emergency staff in Walton, Okaloosa, and Washington counties. The next person that touches this tackle box is going to be in front of a person in need. Uh, it's great to have a, an easy concrete link between the work you do and the benefit it'll have. And that's exactly what they're offering is, hey, you put a kit together, that kit's going to go to work. With the cause now expanding to Washington County and beyond, they're also looking at how to add tools for kids with autism. The noise of all the fire trucks, police cars is aggravating for their, their condition. So we would like to see us add some earmuffs or earplugs to their kit. Um, we'd also like to add some sensory toys. Pinkham said they need help making more tackle boxes with Santa Rosa County and Escambia County on a waiting list. They are giving the next 50 kits made by Cross Point Church to Fort Walton Beach and Niceville departments. In Walton County, Kimber Collins, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Each box costs less than $50 to fill. Different groups can sponsor items or help make boxes. To learn more, go to our website, mypanhandle.com.